man, you gotta talk to me. Negative on that, Briggs. You have any idea how many bridges you burn with that Gitmo stunt? It was necessary. Are you arguing with the results? It's not about the results, and you know it. You pulled agency favors and made the agency look bad. You took the star witness out of play, even if he was chicken feet. Langley doesn't like that. What are you saying? I'm saying don't call anymore. You might want to think about making that transfer permanent. Thanks. Let me know if Ollie needs anything. Apart from some cosmetic damage, it looks like the plane is fine. It's good to hear. Charlie. What? Any update on that hijacked ship we're after? I'm still working on it. They named the attack American Fuel. A loaded tanker would make one hell of a weapon. What the hell just happened? Don't look at me. Graham. The SMI isn't responding. I'm locked out. Charlie? Trying a workaround. Briggs, you got anything? Nothing. All I got is lighting and internal comms. This is the flight deck. We're losing engine power. How long can we glide? We're talking minutes. Navigation systems are down. We have only manual flight controls. We're gonna check the rear panel. I can't get us up and running that fast. I don't even know how they got control of the plane. Talk to me, buddy, damn it! Flight deck, what's going on? This is the co-pilot. We need a medic. What's wrong? The captain cracked his head when the plane dropped. It's bad. He's unconscious. Repeat, the pilot is down. Is the plane under control? Shit. All the engines are dead. Trying to restart. I'm locked out of the navigation controls. Can you fly? Yes. I mean, no. I can try to keep it together manually, keep her in a glide, but I need another pilot. It takes two people to properly work the controls. Briggs, check on the pilot. Where are you going? To get COVID. Try and get the backups online. Try remote access again. Pull the hard drives from the SMI and be ready to wipe them. Come on, Charlie. We need a workaround. Hey, let me guess. We're totally fucked and I'm the only one who can unfuck us, right? Huh? The pilot's unconscious. Shit! Whatever the co-pilot is. flying in manual. I get it, it's a two-man job. Dump the power, kill the backup generator, reboot the system. Okay, I gotta get to the flight deck. Let me out of here, Fisher. Fisher, let me out of here. Take care of the power. Hey, dump some cargo while you're down there. It'll buy us some time. Briggs, head to the back of the plane. We need to lose cargo fast. On my way. I'm leaving a message on the flight recorder in case we don't make it. This is Anna Grimm's daughter. Sam, I've got the cargo bay door open. If you're listening to this message, please contact your local branch. We need to lose weight. Dump the chopper.
power so we can reboot the system. You gotta do it now. The reboot console is under the subfloor, below the SMI. Electrical bay is there. Moving. Generator's offline. All right, good. Now hang on. We need to take her to a deep dive. Get your ass to the cockpit. I need your help with Shana. On my way. What's the problem? He wants to reinstall the whole system mid-flight. Yeah, I'd be done by now if this jackass would get out of my way. He'll crash the plane. What the fuck do you think is about to happen? Let him at it. Exactly. All right. Okay, Fisher, you gotta pump fuel back into the engines, all right? If I get this thing back online, we're gonna have seconds to fire it up. Manual fuel pump controls are in there. All right, once I reboot, you gotta pull back hard, okay? We're gonna get one shot at this. Three, two, one, now! Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, you bitch! Pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up! What's our status? The main systems are back online. She's flying, but we're flying blind. Grim, internal comms work, but the other communication systems are still offline. Hey guys, what the hell just happened? We were hit with a Stuxnet-style virus. I rebooted the SMI from backup, did a full system scrub, we're clean. How did the engineers get a virus on my plane? We'll do the forensics and get you some answers. Oh shit. What now? It's a communique we received right before the plane went dark. The White House activated continuity of government. What does that mean? It means all the top military and government brass were sent to protected bunkers to make sure they survive. The last time that happened was 9-11. Oh my god. Do you think that last blacklist attack... We don't know that yet, Charlie. Just focus on restoring communications. Modified Stuxnet. Modified. Modified. Uh, adaptable to new hardware configurations. Uh, just on the fly. Sends new specifications back home. And then gets reconfigured remotely to match the new system it's in all. This is just beautiful work. I mean, you know, it sucks, but it's beautiful. One of your people did this? Hell no. I was thinking it was one of your buddies. Yeah. Well, this is very elegant. Very dangerous. Can shut down any system it gets into. <laughs> Learn that the hard way. If I were you, I would get across the Atlantic. I want you to keep cycling the frequencies and don't stop until you get through, okay? Briggs, any word on that hijacked ship? Outside communications are almost entirely blacked out. We can't sync up with anyone yet, but the crew's working on it. Charlie. The virus. I found the source. It was executed when we gutted the tablets and picked up a mirror. That's impossible. This is. I streamlined a couple of security protocols. I was just trying to boost operating speed. You let it infect the system? That's how they found us in Mexico. No. 
It was him. When we were on the ground, I contacted a former associate with the cartel. The engineers have a bounty out on us. He must have rolled on me for a cut. Charlie, why we're didn't up. you American fuel attack was successful. That must be why they activated continuity of government. What was the engineer's target? Sorry, Sam. I'm still getting flooded with intel. Got it. Looks like Louisiana, Sabine Pass, a natural gas tanker. Oh my god, Sabine Pass. That's the biggest fuel facility on the Gulf Coast. The engineers hit the facility with a computer virus right before the tanker hit. Security systems, fail safes. Everything was disabled. The virus operates exactly like the one they hit our plane with. Oh, shit. Every fuel facility on the coast has been infected. That fire spreads. They'll all go up one by one. A burning refinery is not the place to go subtle. The SMI's optimal loadout is all about scouting with the tri-rotor and inflicting heavy damage with frags. Approaching jump run, Sam. Ready? Pilot is dropping to half an angel. Reducing speed. And three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Grim, Sam's away. Copy. Here we go. I'm on the ground, headed towards a down chopper. Sam, the seals look like they're taking heavy ground fire. Engineers? Affirmative. They're pinned down. Not sure how long they'll hold out. Friendly! Blade! Chaos! How do you know the countersign? You're not gonna pull the trigger. Stop pointing that thing at me. I'm here to help. Who said we needed help? Where did you come from? Off the books. They tasked you to secure the facility. They sent us to stop the fuel tanker, but they sent us too late. We got here after the crash, then tailed the squad of foot mobiles. We almost got their leader, and then everything went to shit. Grim, I got a high-value engineer target on the ground. Give me a location. Okay. No one gets close. Hang in there.
hostiles are targeting the first responders. On my way. Grim, find me the lead engineer. As fast as I can.
looking for a medevac. Just keep moving. Control. You'll have to neutralize all the engineers before the emergency team can get back to work safely. 